to a quick three of the blood sweat affairs training program. Today we are on the treadmill. So eventually you are going to end up on one of these, whether it's at the gym or you come in to use it because you don't want to train outside for any reason. Um, with your running program, outside training is the most important at off-road training. So get on the grass, get on some gravel, get out on the sand. It's going to prepare you for the long distances and the hills you're going to encounter on the event. But if you have to come into the gym and use the treadmill, we're going to do a little bit of a treadmill program. So we're going to do a couple of unusual things on the treadmill. So this program lasts for 10 minutes. You're going to do one minute of each um, phase and then progress to the next thing. I'm going to do 10 or 20 seconds and progress just so you get an idea. So the first thing, just to warm up, one minute, just a steady walk. I usually put on a little bit of an incline just so that I get nice and warm. Once you've got the hang of the walk, we're going to take it into a nice easy jog. So increase your speed. You still want to be nice and comfortable. And you're going to jog for a minute. So again, just warming up. We'll do that for a minute. Next phase, make it a little bit uncomfortable. Take it into a decent run. Hold that place for a minute. You should be really warm by this stage. So we're going to take it into an uncomfortable sprint. So really start to accelerate and hold it for a minute if you can. Once you've done your minute, decrease. Back down to a steady walk for a minute. So, we are getting active recovery with this minute walk. Then, we're going to take it into some resistance work. With this, I add on a little bit more of an incline. The more incline you have, the more you're going to work into your legs. And you need to slow your speed right down. For me, I slow it down to about 3.2. And we're going to go into a walking lunge. So you're going to hang on lightly. All my weight is on my legs. I'm going to step forward, lunge down, drive up through the heel. So it looks like this. So I need to get down and up before my knee, before my heel comes back behind my knee. So all my weight is on that front foot. Getting both knees, working into the quad and the glutes and the hamstring. One minute of this. Once you've done your minute, go into a steady walk. Get your heart rate back. Increase it to something a little bit weird. And you kind of look like a bit of a dick, but it's really good for your fitness. But we're going to skip like a girl. So, it's quite a fast speed. I've still got that incline on. I'm really working into my carbs. And my heart rate is up. I do this for a minute. Decrease it. Back to a walking pace. Crank out. Extreme hill climb. As high as your treadmill will go. No hands, hands at your side. Walk up the hill. One minute. Same as you've done your minute. Decrease. Straight back into walking lunges. So down my speed goes to three. The hill comes down, straight into walking lunges, dropping it down, push 
job. Way to the heel, upper body's nice and light. Nice tight tummy. One minute of ease. As soon as you don't have a minute, drop your deep time. Work out the speed as fast as you can go. One minute sprint. And that is your treadmill workout. Make sure you do a pull down. The whole program is going to be on the website so you don't get confused. The whole program takes about 10 minutes. Do it two to four times. That'll get you fit really fast.